over to you. Um, how have you processed the last few days and everything that has happened, and, and, and how do you go about the fixing the problems? My name is Sarah Taylor, just as you said, I live at Jay, your daughter, and so on. As you know very well, it's not very easy because we have no time, but uh, we, we are trying to, to solve uh, our problems. Uh, it's not easy because uh, on the pitch uh, we have no time at the moment, uh, but uh, we are trying to, to, to talk with the players. We are uh, trying to, to avoid some mistakes by, by video. It's not it's not easy because uh, we have to play every three days, and so on the pitch uh, we have no time. We heard the fans make their feelings clear about your approach and, and the system. Is that something that you will continue to go with in the hope of improving this, these players in that system, or, or will you consider any changes from a, from a tactical perspective? The uh, the system is a fast problem. Uh, I know very well that uh, when uh, we lose, I have to put a striker on the pitch. When uh, uh, we win, I have to put a defender on, on the pitch, but uh, I want to see the, the football uh, in another way. Um, is this the most difficult time we've had as a manager? Not at all. Not at all. <laughs> I, I had uh, a, a lot of problems in, in the past, especially in, in uh, League One, League Two. It's uh, it's very difficult to be a coach uh, in Italy in uh, League One and League Two. I know we've spoken about it at press conferences throughout the season, um, but a lot of people are saying. Your stubbornness regarding playing in Golo Kante, mm -hmm. where you played for France and Chelsea before, may be in the end your downfall. Do you see that? Do you see no, why people say that? Already because the gent says that if you play in Golo Kante, you're in a position to play. But uh, it depends on uh, how you see football. Uh, in that position, uh, I, I want a player uh, able to move the ball very fast. And uh, this is not uh, the best uh, characteristic uh, of uh, N'Golo. N'Golo uh, is very useful for us, but uh, this one is not uh, his best uh, characteristic. He's won a World Cup and he's won two Premier League Cups. But uh, in another system. Adam, and then Liam. Mauricio, you were saying that there's not very much time on the training ground at the moment. Do you therefore fear that actually things could become worse before they get better? No. I have to think that uh, we are able to improve uh, and uh, we are able to improve immediately uh, because uh, the result uh, is not all in a match. In the last match, uh, we played better better and better, especially in the first half. We have to solve uh, a, a big problem because uh, we, we stayed in the other half for, for uh, 75 minutes uh, <coughs> out of 90 and uh, we were not able to score. They played only 15, 16 uh, balls in our box and uh, they scored two goals. So we have to solve uh, this problem, uh, probably a problem uh, of aggression, of uh, determination uh, in uh, both uh, the boxes. Have you spoken at all to either Marina or Roman in the past few days? No, no not in this week. Liam. Mauricio, the individual mistakes have been a big problem for Chelsea in the last few games. Does there come a time where you as a coach may decide to go with different players in this system to see if they can do a better job. Mm. Sì, 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 s
we are making uh, mistakes uh, with a lot of players. Uh, everybody sooner or later was uh, involved uh, in a mistake. So I think that uh, we need more to change the mentality than the players. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Nizar and then Matt. Mauricio, I was wondering, do you think that there's a possibility you could change by opinion because there seems to be a negative reaction at the moment? Do you think, is that something you find important? Change, As I said in the last press conference, it's very easy. Uh, we need to we need to win uh, three, four matches in a row. Uh, it's the only the only solution. I can uh, understand very well uh, the, the the frustration of our uh, fans uh, because uh, they are used to win. And now we are we are in trouble, and so I can understand very well. But uh, there isn't another way. We have only to to have good uh, performances and uh, good results. So just ask about Bruce Buck. He's been very close with the team lately. Um, is that a normal thing, or is, is, is that? Bruce Buck, yeah. It's normal to say what you say to the squad. Bruce Buck. I don't know. Um, I think so. Here's the president. Okay, we're going to do three more, and then we're going to finish. Matt, Tony, and Char finish with Charlie. Mauricio, do you really believe that you can get those three or four wins in a row? There, there seem to be a few signs of that happening. I think you could have won two or three matches because you could have won two. But, uh, of course, in this moment, it's very difficult to think uh, that uh, we are able to, to win uh, uh, three, four matches in a row. But as you know very well, in football, uh, everything can change uh, uh, in uh, one day. I think that uh, uh, we need, first of all, a good uh, performance, a good result, and then uh, with uh, uh, more confidence, uh, we are able to do everything. OK, last two. Tony, then Charlie. Mauricio, uh, are you confident that you you will eventually succeed, that you will be Chelsea's manager next month, that you will still be here, still doing the job and it will work? I, I have to, to think that uh, I will be the manager of Chelsea for uh, a long time, otherwise I cannot work. Okay. So you're, you're confident that it will work eventually? You're, you're I am not sure, but uh, I have to think uh, this, of course, because uh, I have to work uh, and uh, I want to work uh, with a with a long run target. Last question. You've, you've got a very good chance of getting to the next round of the Europa League. You, you could, you've, you've got a final on Sunday at Wembley, so you could win a trophy. Uh, are you surprised that the Chelsea fans do not seem to be very patient? Because you're in quite a good position. But I think that the problem is the performance and the result in uh, against uh, City. Uh, so for for that match they are right because uh, we we played uh, very badly, very badly without mentality, without uh, soul. And so for for that match I think that uh, they are right. Uh, I don't agree for the last match because uh, we we played uh, a good match, especially in the first half. In the second half, it was really very difficult for us because they, they are a, a physical team. They defended very low, very compact, so it was uh, not easy. But uh, we played well. Uh, we 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 lost for episodium, is it? Episode. Episode. So, so you think that particularly if you win on Sunday, you think you could change opinion quite quickly? But I, I think that Sunday is too far. We need to think to to this match. Both, this both match uh, is a, is a, is a chance to qualify, and so we have to think only only to this uh, at the moment. Then, uh, starting from after the the, the match in Europa League, uh, we can start uh, to think to the other match, but. Now uh, we need to be focused on this match because the match is not easy. Uh, they they are a physical team. They are very dangerous uh, in the opposing uh, boss. They are very dangerous on set pieces. And they are very dangerous away. 
because they qualified uh, away uh, in Istanbul against uh, a very good team uh, as uh, Besiktas. So uh, we need to be careful. Last one. Then we've got to go. uh, we have Thank some you. problems at the moment. Uh, we have uh, Zapacosta with fever. Uh, we have uh, Pedro with a very strong uh, stomachache. And uh, then uh, we have uh, a problem uh, with Kepa, uh, with uh, his uh, hamstring. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I hope so. Uh, I am not sure at the moment, of course, but I hope so. Okay, we'll leave it there. Thank you very much.